Hi, my name is Andy Hunt and in this video I'm going to explain how the Scriptalyzer realistic handwriting font software works. I'm going to show you the theory behind the character substitution that the software uses and then demonstrate the web-based Scriptalyzer interface. First, let's look at the theory. Here is a typed sentence in a typical font. Printed characters like this are neat and orderly. For example, all of the letter E's look identical, and this is not a problem. In fact, this is what we want from a printed font. Now let's change this text into a handwriting font. I've actually selected a premium ultra font here, but as there are no character substitutions yet, it's the same as any other font, and indeed an indication of how a premium service handwriting font behaves. You can see that, although it now looks like handwriting, a quick glance will pick up that all of the letters of the same type are identical. For example, the E's in the word feel, the and effort are all the same. Similarly, the F's in feel and effort, the O's in to and go, they're all identical. This is where the scriptalizer comes into play. Here I've selected just a few of the additional characters that the scriptalizer substitutes to give a more realistic handwriting effect. At the moment all you can see are symbols, but if I change these symbols to the premium ultra font, you can see that they are actually alternative versions, in this case, of the letter E. Moving down to double F, once again, if we change this, we can see that it actually is two Fs in the handwriting. Right, let's change these letters back to the printed font. And change our main sentence back. And let's manually do some substitutions. So, the first letter E. The second letter E. the third letter E. We'll put that at the beginning of effort. Right, these three ending letter E's, let's have that first one. And put it on the end here. And that one we'll put on the end of more. The double F. And finally, OR. OK, if we convert that back now to the handwriting font, and we can see a much better effect. The two E's in feel are different, a different E in effort, and the ending E and the and more, both different, and both specific to that type of handwriting. We can see we now have a double F in effort that looks different, and the O and the R that join differently than if you normally had a printed O and R. So now you've seen the theory behind the scriptalyzer, let's see it in action. In the first part of the video, you've seen how substituting characters for alternatives can produce a more realistic handwriting effect. Now let's see how the scriptalyzer software automates this process. Here is the web-based scriptalyzer software, which is available on our website. The interface comprises of two windows, the upper input window and the lower output window. You can enter text in the upper window using two methods, by manually typing the text in the window, or by copying and pasting text from another source into the window. So here I'll do Control V. To make the character substitutions, click on the scriptalyzer button and the converted text appears in the lower window. Here you can see the scriptalyzed text. To change the font, you use the font selection drop down here. As I'm not logged in as a user, I can see all of the premium ultra fonts that are available to purchase. Let's choose a different font and re scriptalyze. So, why do I have to choose a font? Isn't it the same result with any of the fonts? Well, no it's not. 
Each font has a unique configuration file associated with it. When you change the font, the relevant configuration file is loaded in the background. The configuration file tells the scriptalizer which version of the software the font was made for and whether or not to add starting or ending strokes to certain letters. Now Premium Ultra Font 1 has those starting strokes, so let's change it back. And here you can see um, starting stroke at the beginning of the word feel, the effort. In fact, this handwriting style has starting strokes at the beginning of many letters. And you can see that there are individual strokes. I can delete that one there. In the font size drop down, you can see the recommended font size for the selected font. Please note that this will not change until the scriptalizer button has been clicked. When you copy the output into another application, such as a word processor, this is the best font size to choose to replicate the original handwriting. Let's change to another font and see that font size change. So there you can see that this font is recommended to be reproduced at 28 point. The mistakes drop down allows you to add simulated mistakes in the scriptalizer output. Please note that this is not available for some fonts made using earlier versions of the Premium Ultra specification. The scriptalizer chooses words at the average frequency you select and replaces a letter in the word with an incorrect alternative and adds a crossing out character in front, giving the effect of an error being made and then crossed out. Let's select a mistake frequency and see what happens when I scriptalize the text. OK, so there we can see um, the beginning, the first word, the first letter even, has been replaced with an, an error character and crossed out. And here the word two, uh, an, an alternative character was put at the front and then the crossing out effect. If you are not logged in as a user, as soon as you select a font and click Scriptalize, the Purchase This Font button will appear. Clicking this will take you to the relevant purchase page so you can purchase the font. You will automatically receive a download link by email as soon as you've made your purchase. If you want to have your own handwriting converted into a premium ultra font, then click on the purchase your own custom made font button, which will take you to a page which explains what you need to do. The clear button clears both the top and bottom scriptalizer windows and the help button takes you to the scriptalizer help page. At the right hand side of the scriptalizer there is a login section here at the top. This is only for those people who have had their own handwriting converted into a font. It allows them to access their own font in the font drop down menu. So, for example, if I logged in here with my username and password, my own custom Premium Ultra handwriting font would be available. Finally, the Descriptalize button converts scriptalized text back to standard text. In other words, it reverses the character substitution process and removes all of the special symbols from the text. Let's paste some scriptalized text characters in the lower window and then click the Descriptalize button and you can see in the upper window the converted text appears. So, what happens after you've scriptalized some text? Firstly, remember to use any of the example fonts in an application outside of the Scriptalizer, such as Microsoft Word, you must purchase the font and install it on your PC. If the font is not in your font menu, then it hasn't been installed. Our fonts are compatible with both Windows and Mac operating systems. So, assuming you have the relevant font installed, simply select the scriptalizer text from the lower window and copy it. Here I'll use Ctrl and C to copy. Then open up your application. Here I'm using Microsoft Word and paste your copied text. If you haven't pre-selected the font from the font menu, then you'll not see the handwriting effect. Instead, you'll see many of the substituted symbols. Let's select the text and change it to the handwriting font.
and there you have the handwriting font with the substituted characters giving a much more realistic handwriting effect. Our website also gives some tips on improving the handwriting font further, so go and take a look at that if you get the chance. So that's how the Scriptalyzer Realistic Handwriting Font software works. You've seen the theory behind how substituting characters with alternative versions works, and you've seen how the Scriptalyzer automates the process. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more up and coming videos about our services and products.